So Batman vs. the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles has come out and it was fantastic. What a great portrayal of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. And because it was such a great outing, now the question arises, should the TMNT consider developing more animated movies? And what should they be? Now before we get started, in my opinion, I believe Batman vs. the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles deserves a sequel. Hopefully it performs well enough and we get it. And honestly, if it keeps performing well, it should go as far as being a trilogy, just like its comic counterpart. And if this is the route they go, well, these are probably the Ninja Turtle animated movies we're gonna be getting for a while. That and the rise of the TMNT animated movie we're gonna be getting on Netflix. But I'm talking long term, the next five, 10 years, what would be some TMNT animated movies that we'd wanna see? I'm talking nothing with the crazy budget, just straight to Blu-ray video on demand sprinkled throughout the years alongside whatever TV series they have going on and whatever big budget blockbusters they're working on. Just little independent stories that have nothing to do with anything else that's going on. And that's what we're here to talk about. Here are my seven ideas for what I think should be the next animated Ninja Turtles films. Number one, one thing I think all Turtles fans want to see is just original adaptations. We want to see an original story, original art, something brand new. Kind of like the TMNT shorts they did on Nickelodeon a few summers ago. I don't know if this was them testing the waters with different artists and different directors or whatnot, but I think if they would have taken this the next step into just self-contained animated movies, I feel like that would have been a huge shot in the arm for the Turtles franchise. Seeing different artist takes on the Turtles is always super interesting to see. The Turtles are the perfect franchise to do this with. Whether you like or don't like previous adaptations of the Turtles, it's no doubt that there's always hype to see what are they gonna look like every time a new version comes out. And that's something they need to use to their advantage. That's my number one. Let's move on to number two. <laughs> Okay, number two is probably going to be a fan favorite. They should reunite the cast, or at least get people that sound like them if they can't get everybody, to do a 2003 TMNT animated movie. I've been covering the Turtles now for a little over a year, and one of the most passionate fans I've noticed are fans of the 2003 TMNT series. And rightfully so, the first few seasons of that series was one of the best versions of the TMNT on screen we've ever seen. I say let them have one final hurrah, one more epic story before they ride off into the sunset, but draw them how they were drawn in the earlier seasons. I don't know what happened to them in later seasons, but they look far superior in the first couple seasons. And I think that look would get far more attention. Anyways, that's my number two. Let's take a look at what number three is. Number three, some adaptation of the IDW comics. Preferably these turtles need to be adapted as some sort of TV series, to be honest. But if that's impossible for whatever reason, these versions of the turtles need to be adapted onto the screen somehow. It would be criminal for these versions of the Turtles to never get an on-screen adaptation, and I feel like if they can't get their own television series to resemble the IDW Turtles, at least an animated movie would be pretty cool. These versions of the Turtles are truly a breath of fresh air. The stories always feel so familiar but new. They're always able to capture that nostalgia element of the Turtles, but also bring them to the modern day with their storytelling. Their origin in this version is truly something else, and I really dig it and would love to see it on the screen. If you're a Turtles fan and you've never picked up the IDW comics, for whatever reason, maybe you don't buy comics, maybe it's very intimidating when you look at it, you know, they've been going on for so long, they're almost at issue 100 or whatever, it doesn't matter. Just if you haven't picked them up, I'd say give it a shot because you'll be surprised at how well the turtles have been done in this. Anyways, that's number three. IDW Turtles should be adapted into some sort of animated movie. Let's hop over to number four. Right, suck in the guts, guys, with the Ghostbusters. Number four. Ninja Turtles Ghostbusters crossover. This one might be a little confusing. Some of you might be saying, what? Ghostbusters? It's kind of random. But similar to the Batman Ninja Turtles crossover comic that the latest animated movie was adapted from, there has been a Ninja Turtles Ghostbusters comic. And I feel like both franchises have a lot of crossover when it comes to their fan bases. I would do this one more in the tone 
of the 80s Ghostbusters movies and the 1990 TMNT film, but obviously in animated form. I feel like they could really go off the rails on the goofy side if not done properly. So I hope if they ever do come out with this one, they get fans of those 80s, 90s Ninja Turtles and Ghostbusters to direct and write it. Anyways, not much more to say on this one. Pretty quick Ghostbusters Ninja Turtles crossover, just like the comics. That's my number four. Let's take a look at number five. Sweet! They got little initials on their belt buckles! Like superheroes! Number 5. Turtles Forever Part 2. Turtles Forever was an animated movie that came out in the 2000s that had the 2003 versions, the 1987 versions, and the 1984 comic versions of the Turtles all come together for one epic story. Now obviously since then we've had different versions of the Ninja Turtles appear in animated form. We've had the 2012 series and Rise of the TMNT. And I feel like a Turtles Forever event is something that should initiate a new animated versions of the Turtles into the franchise. It should be automatic. It should be something the fans are waiting for. An unspoken rule that everyone knows. A new version of Turtles is coming out? At some point, we're getting a Turtles Forever movie for them to meet all the old Turtles. Plain and simple, this should be a tradition that the Ninja Turtles should pick up and carry till the end of time. There's so many turtles now though, how would you pull this off? I think they have one last window to have everybody involved. Then after that I feel like you just have to have certain members of each versions of the turtles mix and match and have others sit out. But I feel like you have one more chance to start this trend with the 87 turtles, the 2003 turtles, 2012 turtles and the Rise Turtles, since there's four teams, have them mix and match and have four different missions going on at the same time that all converge into one goal at the end. Maybe have them almost lose and the 84 Turtles bail them out at the last second as one final appearance in these, but after that, reserve these Turtles Forever specials for animated television series versions of the Turtles. That's number four, Turtles Forever, part two. We are ninjas. We strike hard. Defend, protect, and fade into the night. Number 5. If you're a fan of the 2007 TMNT animated movie, you know that the movie is littered with a bunch of loose ends. Things they set up that they were never able to pay off. I talk about it in a whole video. Go check it out. Anyways, I feel like they could do a 2D sequel to this, so just regular 2D animation. And I feel like the hype would be there. A bunch of fans would want to see how their story wraps up, how the Shredder returns, how the Turtles deal with him, and what role Karai would have to play in all this. One of my favorite versions of Karai on screen, by the way. Not much more on this one. Let's take a look at number six. All right then, it's morphin' time. Number six, this one's more of a fantasy of mine. I'm not sure how much the fans wanna see this. This is more of a guilty pleasure of mine that I wanna see. And that's a proper Ninja Turtles Power Rangers crossover animated movie, either versus or working together or whatever. I feel like the Turtles designs, they could maybe go with something original or maybe even use the 1990 movie as inspiration for an animated version for this movie. And I'd like to see them go up against the mighty Morphin Power Rangers, the ones with like the diamonds on their chest. I feel like that's the most iconic version of the Rangers. And I remember as a kid when the Ninja Turtles Power Rangers live action crossover happened, all I kept thinking was, man, I wish the 1990 movie Turtles were meeting the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. That's what I want to see. And to this day, I still want to see it. Shoot, the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers in general should get an own animated series. I have no idea why it hasn't happened yet. Anyways, that's number six. Let's have a look at the last one. Number 7. An animated movie starring the 1987 Ninja Turtles. And although yeah they've been around for ages, we've seen them all over the place, it's no doubt that these are one of the, if not the most iconic animated version of the Ninja Turtles. And the voice actors for the Turtles still hang out from what I've seen. Yes. Welcome to the turtle lair. There are Leonardo walking right behind me. And then there's Michelangelo walking right by me. That's Michelangelo right there, ladies and gentlemen. We got Donnie right there with the guitar. And the beautiful April O'Neil back there. Look at that. Oh, I got antlers coming out of my head. I think they should have one 
more epic story with these OG turtles. Could you imagine popping in the Blu-ray and hearing one last time as the movie's starting a newly animated version of the intro? Same song and everything in same sequences, but just HD, crystal clear. That would be crazy to see in a cool love letter to the turtles that started it all on the screen. Anyways, that's my list of the seven animated turtles movies I feel they should consider developing. Let me know down below. What kind of turtles animated movie would you like to see come out? Maybe I can go over all the responses on a future video. That'd be kind of fun. But yeah, let me know down below. Thanks everyone for stopping by. If you're stumbling across the channel and you just want more Ninja Turtles content in your life, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. That's all we talk about here is new, old, upcoming Ninja Turtle stuff. If you enjoyed the video, go ahead and press thumbs up. That's it for this one, guys. I'll see you in a little bit with another video. Take care. Ninja vanish. Hey, Turtle fans. Thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to follow me on all the social media platforms, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's a good way to stay in touch with the channel. And also, if you want, go ahead and give the video a share on your social media platforms, Reddit, Twitter, all that stuff and let's spread turtle mania to the world once again thanks everyone for watching it really does mean a lot